mucosal melanoma is a distinct subset that can still occasionally uh, respond just as well uh, to uh, nivolumab ipilimumab combination. Less often uh, does uh, does it you know provide long term survival to you know nivolumab, although these numbers are still pretty small, uh, so it's not uh, ever going to be you know, randomized trial that gives us a definitive answer without any doubts at all in this rare disease. Um, but for most of, uh, most patients who can tolerate toxicity, I think this cements uh, nivolumab plus ivolumab as the preferred frontline uh, agent uh, to treat patients with mucosal melanoma. And we can look someone in the eye in clinic who has stage four mucosal melanoma and say, you know, there's a documented, uh, you know, rate of long-term survival uh, when we use these two drugs. And we know the toxicity to look out for. It's no different than uh, it is for anyone else that we treat with melanoma.